what was one of the most emotional days on the set for you? Everyone's going to give you the same answer, which is Carnaval del Barrio. Um, that was a song we had to fight to include. If you look at it from a story what? perspective, <laughs> not much happens in it, right? Like they're sad, they rally, they're <laughs> joyous. Um, but it contains so much the essence of the themes of the movie in terms of like, how do we define home? How do we define community? How do we face the challenges that are facing us? And so we had one day to film the whole thing. The entire eight minute number is, is, is from sun up to sundown behind four blocks uh, in the 170s. And um, in fact, uh, well, I better not say that part because I'm giving away someone's address. Uh, but there, there was a, there's a Heights original cast member who lives in one of those buildings. Um, and we, um, and it was just, um, it was just a joy from beginning to end. I've never been on a movie where they yelled cut and people refused to stop dancing because we were so proud of having accomplished it and, and represented where we're from, uh, so loudly and boldly. I just love like all the other little cameos of Christopher Jackson playing Mr. Softy opposite you. I, I, I love finding all the little Easter eggs the first time I watched the film. Yeah, and there are there are more even than those. I mean, from the you know the name of the singer on the Siempre Bolero when the record is spinning is my real abuela uh, Edmunda Claudio. Um, if you look carefully during Breathe, we have a framed picture of Priscilla Lopez in the in the apartment. Uh, so she is still canonically Camila Rosario. Uh, so many Easter eggs um, in in this uh, in this thing, and and um, and then of course so many original cast members uh, on the vocals and um, in you know it's throughout the film.